So this week's objective is to take all the subtasks of all the things that we trained on and give them the opportunity to have a relook at it, train the objectives, and then leading into the culmination exercise, have the best opportunity to succeed. They were put into groups and put into teams and it was broken down and they deliberately and methodically planned each operation. Now that they culminated, they're not just planning to plan, they're planning to execute an end state and objective. We want these guys to work instinctively, so that way it frees up their ability to think and see things uh, as they happen. Elite Advance are given uh, their most important tool, and that is the Advanced Checklist. The Advanced Checklist is uh, more or less a guide. We want to be able to have them operate in real time and be conscious of what's happening around their environment. The scenario was that a meeting was to be had with the host uh, to discuss the increase in protests for the principal's presence. In contingency-based planning, we want them to be prepared to execute the alternate plan when the primary plan goes wrong. The key evaluation piece to this is, can the detail remain calm and composed? Can the shift leader continue his organization uh, of the protection detail where they can safely remove the principal from that type of condition or situation to a safer location? Uh, myself and the rest of the instructor cadre uh, were very impressed on the decision-making process uh, that they had, their planning process, and the overall outcome.